Hey guys, welcome back to my channel for another What's in My Five Kids Stockings. Today I am sharing what is in my nine-year-old son and 11-year-old son's stockings. I decided not to split their videos up because they're very similar in age and interest, so they're getting very, very similar things. So if you missed my last video, which was what is in my five-year-old daughter's stocking, I will link it up here and down below. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, for warning, if you did miss my last video, I know it's a lot of stuff. We go way overboard with stockings. We follow the four gift rule with under the tree, but my tradition in my family growing up was my mom was like the best stocking stuffer, shopper. It was a whole thing. It's a whole thing in our house. We spend the morning on stockings, then we break for brunch, and then at lunch we open presents. So stockings are our big Christmas morning. So keep that in mind. Also, none of this actually fits in the stocking. It's like set up where they're sitting when they wake up in the morning, um, <laughs> set up like on the couch or in the chair or whatever with the stocking somewhat stuffed and then little wrapped gifts around it. So um, I know that none of it's going to actually fit. So first things first, the treats that they're getting, they're both getting a, ooh, it's real bright there. Um, they're both getting a set of Yum Earth gummies. They're both getting a set of these little chocolates from Target. They are both getting a little miniature, adorable Nutella. All four of my older kids are getting all of these things that I'm sharing. Um, they each got a candy cane chocolate, like, you know, tailored to their tastes and favorites. So my 11 year old son's favorite is Kit Kat. My nine year old son's favorite is Snickers. Um, so there's that. And then they also each got one of these little popper things um, because I did it to myself. I don't know why, but I thought it was fun. I don't, I don't know. I still don't know why I did that. Um, but they are less annoying than like some things, right? I don't know. Uh, so this one is for my 11 year old son and this one's for my nine year old son. Um, I got them these little miniature Crazy Aaron's Thinking Putty, which I really like this brand, and we are not a slime-free house. My kids do really well with slime, and they grab the trays, and they sit at the table, so um, I got my 11-year-old son this Coral Reef one. It actually came in a four-pack, so I got him this Coral Reef one, and then I got my 9-year-old son this Flame one, but I just liked the size of those. And then they each got a new toothpaste. We got the Quip toothbrushes last year, so I, they're not getting new toothbrushes this year because that subscription program has been amazing. So I got my son this juicy grape flavor and then my other son this blue raspberry flavor. I am a little funny with toothpaste. Um, everyone has to have their own toothpaste, their own mouthwash in our house. So there's four toothpastes, four bottles of mouthwash because I like, just, I don't know, I, I can't have <laughs> some kids who will like put their mouth right on things and I'm like, I'm not gonna do that to you guys. So everyone gets their own things. Um, all of my kids also got their own new canoodle this year. So for my older kids, I got them both this canoodle extreme and this one looked really neat. We like these canoodle games. We've had quite a few of them. And then for my son, I got this canoodle duplexity, a two-tone test of logic and reasoning. And this is a magnetic one for on the go, which is perfect because we are going on a big trip right after Christmas. Um, they all also got a My Year of book. So these Be Creative Everyday books from Usborne, 365 different activities. So for my nine-year-old son, I got these 365 nature-inspired activities. And for my 11-year-old, 365 STEM-inspired activities. Um, these are just perfect little stocking stuffers. So um, they just do little different doodles and writing prompts based on the theme of their book. So that was the STEM one. Here's the nature one. Um, just little writing and art prompts for each day of the year. I love those books so much. Um, and then they each got a game, a card game this year in their stocking. So my nine-year-old son, I got him this pizza party dice and card game. So this says, 
A fast and frantic dice game for two. Roll your dice to match the toppings on your slice. Keep rolling until they all match. Now grab another card and keep going. The first player to create a whole pizza wins. So that looked fun. Again, like I wanted them each to have a different game to travel with us on this trip. And then my son, I got him super sleuth vocabulary game, crack the codes and solve 180 plus vocabulary mysteries with a secret decoder inside. So got him that one. I'm a big fan of educational games. So I thought that would be perfect for him. Did it have an age on it? Great, age is eight and up, grade three and up. So that was for him. Um, all four of my older kids also got a set of these little um, sun print kits. We've had the bigger size, but these are the smaller ones. These are four inches by four inches each. And I think they each come with 10 prints to make, I believe. Um, and so to make these, you put a piece of cardboard that's in here. Uh, the the blue paper facing up like a feather or a leaf or some kind of object that you find on top and then some another plastic sheet and then you expose it to the sun for a few minutes and then you quickly rinse it with water and then it creates their little nature prints. So I thought they would like those for their nature journals. Um, they also got another little trinket um, that, you know, what was I thinking but Christmas. So they each got one of these little claw machine toys um, and then they also each got a pair of sunglasses. So for my nine-year-old son, I got him this little orange pair from Target. These, the, these are for the trip. Some of these are like having the trip in mind. And then for my 11-year-old son, I got him these two cool for school sunglasses that everyone wears now. They had a really nice case and they are these ones. His favorite color is purple. I don't think you can tell in the video here, but it's got like a purple tint to it. So those are his. And they all, they all need sunglasses every now and again. We live in Florida and they need them. Um, they get scratched up, they get used on a daily basis. So they all needed a new set for this trip. Um, they did all also get a paint by sticker book. So I got the paint by sticker dogs for my 11 year old and this general paint by sticker for my nine year old. So it comes with all of the little um, pieces there and then the sticker pages that coordinate. They're like mosaic sticker books. Um, they each got a bath bomb. So I got this earth bomb for my older son and the galaxy bomb for my younger son. And these all have a little toy inside. And then um, for my boys, they each got a larger Crazy Aaron's Thinking Putty, these dino scales ones, which I think they're going to think those are really fun. And then um, I got a set of magnetic bookmarks for my nine-year-old son uh, for the Bible from Daily Grace Co. And I got a set of these um, books of the Bible bookmarks for my 11-year-old son for youth group. Um, these are cool. They have the genre, author, time period, and length of each book in the Old and New Testament, as well as the major themes in that book of the Bible. So they can be used as like a little Bible study tool. Um, for my, they each got a gingerbread Funko Pop. Funko Pops are a new thing to them and they've asked everyone for them this year. So I got them each one, Captain America for my nine-year-old son, Iron Man for my 11-year-old son. Last couple things here. My daughter got the uh, a set of the one of these, and so I got them for my other kids as well. Last year for Christmas, they got switch lights, and so I got them each a travel case for the trip. Um, these were pricey. These are pricier than I would normally put in a stocking, but I had already gotten them. There's something they need, and they really do need this for the trip. So I, I was like, I'm gonna buy them anyway, so I'll put them in their stocking. So these are really neat travel cases that can also hold the games and they can play their Switch right in it. It's got like a little thing to prop their Switch up. So they each got one of those. <clears throat> um, my nine-year-old son got a new set of film for his, um, Inst is it Instax? Instax camera. I got him this little stone gray film as well as this fidget um, cube thing. Um, he asked me specifically for one of these. It's been a while since we've had one in the house. I don't know if it's showing up on the camera, but it's one of those that has the little different 
clicky buttons and things. And then for my 11 year old son, he got a pop socket. He has a gab phone, so I got him a pop socket for that. And then a set of exercise dice because he loves creating workouts for him and John to do or just to do in his room. And so he'll write up these workouts from judo and work on them. And so I thought he would actually really enjoy these exercise dice. And I just got these from Home Goods. So that is everything that is in my nine and 11 year old son's stockings. If you have boys around that age or girls around that age, let me know in the comments down below what you're putting in their stockings. And I will see you back here soon for another video. Bye guys.